Hello everyone, in this video I would like to cover problem 47 for pre-calculus. Alright, so we have sine x equals one half. Got it, so we have sine x equals one half. Well, for x uh, staying between 0 and 720. For x staying between 0 and 720. Okay, so we have all these information and I just need to solve for sine x equaling one half. Now, first off, the very first idea that we can get, the obvious answer is just going to be sine x equaling sine 30. So, in other words, this is, this is an obvious uh, picture from the special right triangle. We know that sine 30 is just going to be 1 half. But at the same time, we know how to find out the corresponding picture. Well, sine 30, the corresponding equations, I would say, will be sine 150 as well. Because we know that the, the supplementary pair is also going to have the same sine value. So we just have found that x equals 30 and 150. But is that the only possible values? Well, I can tell you that after one full rotation, we're going to, get an, we're going to end up getting the same answer. So in other words, I can actually find out sine 390. Now, sine 390 is also going to be 1 half. So in other words, we have 390, right? And at the same time, if I just make sure that one third, you know, three, 360 being added up in that number, which is, I would say 510, well, we get the proper information. Like if we're just adding 360 to this number to make one full rotation and we have another full counterclockwise rotation from 30 to get 390. And of course, we get those four solutions and we're just looking for the sum of all possible values, right? So we just have to add up, add up all those numbers. All right, so 30 plus 150 plus 390 plus 510. That becomes 180. And I would say this becomes just 900. So uh, we're adding up these values to come up with 1080. And this will be the answer for the question. 